decades in the works, but construction of the Herkimer County Jail is complete. News Channel 2's Kirk Tupai takes us to the facility. This ribbon cutting marks the end of a process that started in the late 90s. The state of New York mandated that Herkimer County build a new jail. Overcrowding and new regulations plague the old facility that was built in 1978. The new jail now occupies the former PNC site on Route 28, but the chairman of the Herkimer County Legislature says acquiring a suitable site was a lengthy process. Over 50 sites were looked at throughout the county, uh, various sites uh, in various communi different communities. Uh, they were all vetted, um, and we had some uh, hiccups along the way with some lawsuits uh, that, that slowed the process. Property taxpayers didn't have to foot the bill for this project, and there's been no financial help from the state of New York. The new facility is being fully funded with a quarter percent sales tax that was set in place in 2007. The county is hoping to have the project paid for in seven to ten years, at which time the quarter percent sales tax will sunset. Herkimer County Sheriff Scott Scherer says all that's left to do now is transfer the inmates over and decommission the old jail. I will make the final plans, they'll get approval. We'll come up with a date uh, to move our incarcerated individuals. The first thing we'll do is we'll move the ones out of our current facility um, on, a, on a certain day, an undisclosed date, and then on another undisclosed date, we'll go and pick up the ones from another facility. Inmates will be transitioned into the new jail over the next few weeks, and when the jail is fully functional, taxpayers can expect to see a cost savings of $26,000 a month. In Herkimer, I'm Kirk Tupai reporting for News Channel 2.